Man, I really, I really wish that y'all could hear it. <laughs> the stuff that happens before the final mix. It's been a long day, anyway. it's been a long week. So give it up for the king of no sleep, and you know we're feeling alright. Ah. Alright. What's up, guys? We got Crimson tonight. What's up, What's up guys? It's DC. We got Money Mitch. Yeah. We got Luke Skywalker. We got Solus tonight. Music. And we got Wagon tonight. Wagon the building. How you doing, man? Good, man. How are you? Good. Now, how did it all begin? I started rapping my junior year. Just, I didn't say it all my life. You know, I just put them in my hand. I tried it a few times. A few times. Didn't really get anywhere, but then I kind of stuck with it. So, I mean, what are you doing right now, man? Right now, I'm just performing everywhere. I'm working on the mixtape, Vince is mine, and me and my team, we just traveling, trying to perform anywhere we can. And we got a couple labels looking at us, but we really trying to expand, see what else for other tapes. I used to just rap, never really thought of a name. Someone asked me what my name was, and I was just, just said it on the spot. It's kind of been that ever since. Tell me, man, how did this whole thing start for you? For me, it started back in 2006. A good friend of mine, uh, TJ Pompeo, went up to New York, started messing around with his cousins that do hip hop up there, brought it back down to us, and told me as a junior in high school we were gonna rap. And I was like, I don't rap. I'm a little white guy from Broadway. <laughs> but uh, but we started out recording songs in his den over you know normal hip hop beats, and just grew from there. Just developed on talent and tried to go from there. Everybody, yo, everybody, you know, see something they like and they want to do it. So a couple years ago, like six years ago, you know what I'm saying, my homie was doing music, and I was around music for his time, you know what I'm saying? But it was my thing. And I started just listening to music, listening to different people coming up and shit, you know what I'm saying? So he gave me, I got an opportunity to start doing something, and I started doing something, and people was liking it. So, I mean, now they are here because of people, you know what I'm saying? They're the ones that like what I do. So I stay doing my music, thanks to them. Yeah. So what are your influences? What do you listen to the most? I mean, right now, I listen to mostly J. Cole and Wale, you know, okay. you know artists like Lecrae, and, um, you know, some, some positive guys, some people that have a, a story to tell is what I like to listen to. Um, my favorite rapper is J. Cole. I listen to a lot of big shout-outs too. I like a lot of shout-outs. Who knows? I've been writing poetry for a real long time, like, Middle school, probably before then, just that's always what I've been about. Anytime I was thinking about anything too hard, I just did that to let all my feelings out. So from then it just gradually progressed until high school when I recorded, I guess, my first couple tracks with uh, Lee, aka Crimson, and TJ, like the truth. Well, it's TJ now, but uh, yeah, man, that was, that was basically where it started. So, what are your influences? What do you listen to? What drives you, Bell Oh man, I want to be like, not want to be like right, this, right. but like. I want a sound or whatever. Well, I mean, I listen to me all the time. Boy, yeah, boy, boy. boy. It's always good. Boy, I mean, I like T.I., you know what I'm saying? Uh, Tupac, that's my influence. I love Tupac. Rest in peace, you know what I'm saying? And Tempo, he's a Spanish artist that he just like a Tupac, in Spanish version. You know what I'm saying? So, you know what I mean? That's, the, that's my influence, you know what I mean? Now, what do you have for the future? What do you have planned? Any shows are you looking forward? Oh, man. Uh, the HMA shows I'm looking forward to, man. I'm always picking them up whenever I can. Right now, the things I'm working on the most is trying to just write my whole own album because, uh, like, my vision for rap is less rap and more, man. Like, more poetry, man. Any uh, Facebook, Twitter you want to send out? Uh, you can follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash Music or facebook.com slash Sollers ABWA. Uh, any plans for the future? It's like you said, uh, you know, in this area, I mean, my name is getting around, and that's such a blessing. I love that so much. Um, but we're really just trying to build off of that. Um, currently, I live in Columbia, South Carolina, so we're kind of experimenting in that. Yeah, yeah, six and a half hours. We're uh, we're trying to build that market up. Teamed up with a good group of artists down there named uh, Young Justice. Um, one part is Hero, and the other part is Light Gray. And we've just been doing some songs, trying to build a fan base down there. Just spread, man. A lot of beat is coming out. A lot of shit. Stay tuned. That can find me on PreferNation.com slash wagon, Facebook.com slash Global Music. You know what I'm saying? Google my ass if you want. Wagon, W-A-W-G-Y. Well, good luck, man. Appreciate it.
Crimson Music with a Z I K. Remember that. I'm getting older, look, I grew up. M4s, I blew up. I just tutored the students. It's cold as hell.